welcome to Koh Samui everyone. We arrived here yesterday after a very long travel day. So we started off in Krabi as you've seen, we took a tuk-tuk that took about 20 minutes to get to the bus station. We then took a three and a half hour bus or a three hour bus to get to Saratani which we waited for two hours to take another bus to the ferry terminal which took an hour and then we took an hour and a half ferry over to the coast of Mui Island before catching our taxi to our hotel which took about half an hour and then we arrived in our hotel called the Top Hostel Samui <laughs> Cute. This is very budget. It was 400 baht a night, nine pound. What and more do we need? We're here for three nights, so oh, yeah. we've got two Dude. full days pretty much. So we've literally just got these two twin beds with a bit. I wonder if you can see the sea, because the sea is literally just down there. So we'll head there straight away, is it? Yeah. And then we've just got a sink oh. and a wet room. Toilet, shower. Water, water, water. Oh, and there's water. Woo. I could do with that right now, to be honest. Yeah. What more do you need? We're here to explore for two days and then we move on. We then ventured out to get some food before having an early night ready for a full day of exploring today. We're currently down on Chaweng Beach and as you can see, it is absolutely incredible. The waters are really blue, the sand's really white, the skies are really blue, there's no clouds. Oh, there are clouds, but... Not many. <laughs> not many clouds. Yeah, the water here is even warmer than we've experienced in Krabi and in uh, Phuket. So, unfortunately, I am still on the mend. I don't think salt water is a good idea. So we won't be going in today, Kelsey might. Maybe, yeah, but I'll be to enjoy the nice Yeah, but it is really warm. But yeah, we're going to take a walk down this beach, to check it out, see what we come across. There seems to be like an island all the way in the distance. So maybe we can get onto that, but we'll see, we'll see. We found a little spot in the shade on the beach overlooking the sea. This is the current view. I can't believe how blue the water is. It's cool because you can see like the different shades of blue yeah. as it goes deeper and deeper. It's really cool. There are a few more waves here than we've seen. Yeah. And there is a lot of rubbish on the beach, which is disappointing. Because that's the first time we've seen like like a lot of rubbish on the beach. Yeah. It is a big beach, it's spread out, it's not like piles of rubbish but there's just like empty bottles and uh packets just yeah, like lifted all the way down the beach which is a shame people don't pick it up like you ruin places like this by lifting but anyway first impressions of kosamui as we were driving in on the taxi there's these big mountains in the middle of the island isn't there and then you've just got beaches all the way around pretty much it's really picturesque paradise yeah um I think this is some of probably the clearest waters we've seen, I would say. Apart from Caron Beach, I would say this is probably the next and Rayleigh Beach. And after we checked in, obviously we went for a walk yesterday just to get some food. It seemed quite quiet. So the road we walked down was just a really long stretch and there wasn't many people about. There was like taxis and tuk-tuks going up and down, sort of like beeping at you and stuff. And there was a few restaurants, but they weren't like full. There weren't many people in them. So unless we're just in a quiet area, maybe we'll head further down this way today and uh, check out more of the area and hopefully come across some sort of market or something, maybe food later, we don't really know. But for now, we have picked up some bread. And some ham. And some ham, and we're having some ham sandwiches which we haven't had, we miss. Kelsey loves ham, she has it all the time back home. Um, so yeah, we're just having a little bit of a picnic, I guess, on the beach. And then we're gonna carry on walking. As I said earlier, hopefully we can get onto this island and check that out. But we'll see. For now, ham sandwiches. We've got our ham sandwiches. Mm. 
the ham surprisingly good. It's weird that you miss the simpler things like a ham sandwich when you've been away from home for so long. Yeah, it's just like a bit of home comforts, I guess. Mm. And what have you to be eating it with? I love how they've just got like random swings on all the beaches in Thailand. Just tied to some of these palm trees. Coconut trees. Palm trees or coconut trees? I also trees? feel like it's a necessity to have to sit on the swing every time you see a swing. Sideways. <laughs> this is the worst. worst. Good view. Yeah, good view. Terrible swing. It's the way he's tied onto the tree. <laughs> Guys, the sea in this area here is hot. Not warm, hot. Like, if I had a pack of noodles or a tea bag or something. I'll be cooking. There's some uh, potatoes in here now. Maybe you get done in a couple of, couple of minutes. Oh, it's mad. It's like when you turn the, the hot tap on in, in, the a, in the shower, like or in the sink. When you turn the hot tap on and and the water's hot, obviously. <laughs> it's crazy. Like that's. It's not just me, is no, it? it? That, is. That's it's hot. hot. Almost like when you got in there, like you stood out a minute because you were like, oh, that's too that's hot. That's too hot. Crazy. 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 Let's get crazy. I love how these palm trees look on the beach as well. Just here. It's all the way down. It is just like paradise. It looks like it's really easy to get over to the island. So this is really, really shallow. So you might be able to walk it, if not definitely swim. But I haven't got my swim shorts on, so we're not going to do that today, maybe tomorrow. I'm going to have a really nice day tomorrow as well, so... Yeah, so we're going to head more inland and we're going to head to the shopping centre that we've seen and check that out and then hopefully we'll find a market a little bit later to have some lunch. But yeah, for now we're just going to head up there, check that out and see what's about. This place is actually really cool. It's like a massive outdoor seating area here. You've got the food hall, which is where we just walked through as like, it's basically like a big supermarket. You've got all these like food vendors all the way around this little seating area. And then there were some little shops selling clothes. And then you've got this inside massive bit, which we're gonna check out. It's really cool. I love how the shopping mall is like half inside, half outside, like you've got all the trees and stuff. Like they've got the shops here and then the walkway on like the outside balcony and then all the trees and stuff in the middle. And then you've got oh, wow. more shops. And like a big... Like market sort of thing. It's cool. It's a cool shopping mall, isn't it? Yeah, very cool shopping mall. Never seen one like this. Like inside, outside sort of... Yeah. It's cool. Ah, and it's really big for being just on Koh Samui Island. Yeah, it looks quite small from the outside. Yeah. So opposite the shop mall across the road, there is this cool lake. And then you can see the mountains in the background. I did not know Koh Samui was so mountainous. And I didn't know it was so big either. It's actually quite a big island, isn't it? Yeah. What was the population? Like a hundred and something thousand? I think so. Yeah. There's quite a lot of people on here. It's quite a big island. It takes half an hour. It's because the road, the main road goes all the way around like a loop. 
it takes half an hour to get from one side up to the other so pretty cool we were going to rent the bike to explore the island more and see more inland but with my head and i had a bad foot yesterday <laughs> Yeah, and we have heard that there are quite a few accidents on Coast Marie, so we've yeah, been there, miss. Our friends crashed. Yeah, they did. Hope you're okay, guys. Um, well, we know they're okay. There were so many things telling us not to rent the bike, we decided not to rent the bike. We might don't call Pony Anglo, which yeah, is where like we're the, going in a couple of days. Yeah, it was like the world was telling us, just don't rent a bike. On Coast Marie, yeah. Don't do it, so we didn't. There is something up there, which I don't know if we're going to try and get to. Should we try and head up there? Let's see how far it is, is there? Yeah, I'm trying to maybe. see what this lake's called. Give me a sec. Oh, Chowing Lake. So it's a beach. Oh, fair. Chowing Beach, Chowing Lake. <laughs> and Chowang what? What Chowang? Probably, yeah. <laughs> we'll have a look now. Yeah, so it's a 15 minute walk to get up to the top. Um, so we're going to head up there. It does look as if there's some pretty good views. We made it to the spot. The pagoda. It's a massive gold like bell shape with four towers and just a class 360 view. We've got Kosovo Airport, that's Kopanyang Island. This is uh, the beach we were on earlier here. That's that little island that we were going to try and walk to. Wow. And then you should be able to see the lake on this side. Yeah, you can. So this was the lake we were at and the beach we were on stretched us all the way there and we're staying over there somewhere. It's pretty cool up here. Such a good view. This wasn't even a place either that was recommended on Google when you searched like best things to do in Koh Samui. We'd just seen it and we thought, ah, oh, we go up and check it out. There's only a 15 minute walk from the, the lake down there. But the views up here are insane and you've got all the mountains. But we need to head back over there. What are you? Should we head back down? Yeah, excuse my red face. I know something. This is what happens when I uh, sweat and get really warm. Okay, so I've just been editing the video. Realised we haven't done an outro. We're going to end it here. If you're on the road here, please hit subscribe. Give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. And we will see you again in the next one.